having that duress on turn one was great the game before. Or let's get set up for, for a nice upheaval. So for upheaval, we're just going to need our Balsam Monolith and Power Stone down and some, some other mana ramping. Some of our, some of our, some of our moxes. Yes. Okay, we have the Power Stone, Restoration Angel, Karn. This is a keep. Just need to get another planes so we can uh, get Elspeth down. Okay, I'd be willing to toss in Bitter Blossom. It's just it's so hard to think of what I might might be taking out. Like Phyrexian Revoker. Wrath of God. If this is guy's green ramp, that is amazing for us. But see double white, we still need our we still need our other white source. Alright. That's our other white source. And then we just get the power stone down. Two, three, four, five. Then we could do well Elspeth her plus one is not gonna be great with Oath of Druids. Sword of Fire and Ice. Two, three, four, five, six. Oh we almost have Karn. Oh, two, three, four, five, six, seven. We can Karn right now. Karn, Karn. I think we need to do that yet. Let's just get into this XLR card. <laughs> he just doesn't want to play against a Karn. Okay. He just conceded the whole match? That was game one. Is that just a rage quit? That must be just a rage quit. Okay. Uh, well, I'll take your advice and we'll throw in a bitter blossom. Uh, I guess bitter blossom with like kind of Armageddon is good, so I won't want to take Armageddon out. So the only choices we have here. I was really wanting removal for the last game, so I don't want to take out, go for the throat. Uh, so again, it's either Phyrexian Revoker, which I really like in her hand. <laughs> yeah, it is pretty strong, but it's also like, okay, let's go into game two, right? Um, I really don't know what to cut here for... Or bitter blossom. Well, I'll take up Phyrexian Revoker. I really don't want to, but I um, also have a lot, a lot of other cards here that I don't want to get rid of. Yeah, so we'll keep this. Let's play our match three.